Write down the date first. Today we have, uh, by the way, today is Thursday. Today 11th of April, so write down the date. And write down our topic, school life. We will continue speaking about Elastali and the Lyceum. Also, you will describe how you see ideal school or school of future. And also you will learn some information about education in Britain. Do you remember at the previous lessons we described the model people? Yes, we did. We did. Uh, but I can't say that all the pupils are model. And there are some who don't study very well. He is one of such pupils. But he has a pen friend in the USA. And he wrote a letter to him about his studying. Perhaps he thinks that he has made some mistakes and he uh, has brought this letter to me and asked to check, to help him. Let's do it together. Okay? Let's try. So now your task is to read this letter and if you see some mistake, we will correct it. So, Kimofi, uh, can you see it? Uh, the screen? Yes. Read the first sentence. Uh, I read in school uh, five days a week. Uh, we don't study on the Saturday and Sunday. Do you see any mistakes here? Pay attention to the vocabulary because I am afraid that this uh, boy doesn't know the words, uh, words quite well. Roma. Uh, I think uh, I attend school. Of but, course. Uh, what do we visit? Uh, we can visit. Uh, we can visit uh, some relatives. Uh, yes, exhibition, people. picture gallery, museum, but we attend school. Good. Uh, I don't know, read the next sentence. On the lessons, we answer to the teacher's questions, uh, make the project work, revise new words after the teacher's teacher and learn English by heart. Mm -hmm. So, a very long sentence. So, let's start from the very beginning. What mistake do you see here? At the lesson, right, your Alena, what else do you see? To answer the teacher's questions. Go to Anya. Revise, repeat. Repeat. And when do we use revise? Oh, Anya. Uh, revise. Um, what does it mean to revise? Uh, revise uh, that uh, when. Uh, Give we, synonym of the uh, word revise. Revise information repeat. in memory. It, uh, it means to, to, to memorize something, to, memorize. to remember. And to repeat means to, to pronounce again, yes, after the teacher. Uh, and do you see any other mistake in this sentence? Yulia? No, this letter hasn't... No, 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 in this sentence. Ah, in this sentence? Yes. Mm -hmm. Learn English by heart. What do we learn by heart? Poems. 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 What else? Rules. Rules, words maybe, but can we learn English by heart? Yes. Only some part of English, but not the whole language. Yarina, read the next sentence. After the lessons, I take part at the competitions, I go to excursions. Mm -hmm. uh, I take part in the competitions, go on the excursions. Right, you are. So the next sentence, Vika. Uh, teacher say... Louder. <coughs> teacher say, I hear a uh, guitar music. Mm -hmm. um, say, did you just say? No, say, Kajun, why not? Um, mm, uh, Who can see the mistake here? Gift for music. Right, you are Roma. Gift, gift for music, good. So continuation of this letter, Julia. <coughs> Now I'm resistance, I don't like to work hard and I don't uh, do my homework I go. Uh, so if a person doesn't work hard and doesn't do his homework regularly, is he persistent? No. How can you call him? Lazy. Lazy. And who is, uh, what pupil is persistent, Yelena? Uh, persistence, uh, are pu uh, uh, we can uh, uh, we can call. We can call people's persistence when they do all homework and uh, uh, attend clubs uh, and uh, uh, 
take part in, uh, in uh, extracurricular activities. Right, yeah. So, uh, Anya, the next sentence. Uh, I have a good time management, that's why I'm sometimes late on the lessons and uh, don't have time to do all the tasks. Um, uh, Yes, I have a bad time management. And any <coughs> other mistake about being late? To be late for lessons. Yes, to be late for lessons. Okay, so, and you see how it's signed, best wishes, Andrei Filatov. So, what about the whole letter? And yeah. this letter we see there is no, there aren't no paragraphs. Yes. And uh, in, uh, the letter should have paragraphs. Yes, and, and as it's a friendly letter, there mustn't be a surname. Surname, only the name, right? Yeah. So let's repeat some uh, phrases from the le uh, from this letter after me. So to be late for. To be late for. To repeat after the teacher. To repeat after the teacher. To revise the rules. To revise the rules. To attend school. To attend school. To learn work by heart. To learn words by heart. To go on excursions. To, to go on excursions. excursions. To be persistent. To be persistent. Um, well. To take part in. To, to take, take part in. in. Mm -hmm. So answer some of my questions. Uh, do you take uh, part in sport competitions at the Lyceum, Kimafei? Uh, yes, of course. I took uh, part in sport competition in this Lyceum. I took part in the football uh, championship uh, mm -hmm. uh, and uh, also I, uh, I um, took part in table tennis competition. Uh, okay, thank you. What about the concert, Natasha? Do you take part in concerts? As far as I know, you do. What can, what talent do you have? What gift do you have? Natasha, don't worry. Can you sing well? I, I sing songs. Yes, you sing songs and you take part in the concert. So what about uh, being late for classes? Yarina, are you late for classes? No, I never late. I'm never late for classes. And when you started at school, were you late for classes? No, I can before lessons. Right. Uh, Vika, what about you? Sometimes I can be late. I can be late in the class. For four, four classes. But I am a child. But I try. Uh, I try uh, to to come to in time. Mm -hmm. uh, what gift, Anya, do you have? Uh, I have gift uh, for music uh, and I hope I have gift uh, for English language. Mm -hmm. What about Alina? Uh, I have gift uh, for uh, dancing. Good. So uh, now I would like you to tell us something about uh, your study in Brazil. Here you see some expressions. Choose any you like and say something about yourself, about your study, about your life here using this expression. Okay. Timothy is ready. Uh, in general, my impressions uh, uh, at the Lyceum uh, are, are positive because, uh, uh, firstly, I met uh, new uh, people uh, who became uh, as, uh, friends for me. Uh, Do you see the word combinations? Ah. You have to use one of them. Okay, uh, who is ready? Uh, I is ready. Uh -huh. <laughs> Uh, I like uh, Lyceum very much because uh, uh, this is uh, uh, this is extracurricular activities. Uh, I take part in extracurricular activities, uh -huh. and uh, if I uh, uh, learn uh, all uh, lessons uh, for uh, all homework good, I uh, have get top marks. Uh, and uh, I get not have I get top marks. Yes, yes. Uh -huh. and. Uh, uh, I am interested in uh, English. Uh, this uh, uh, English, our English, is very interesting. Always uh, uh, we uh, done. Uh, uh, we do um, <coughs> different uh, work. Kinds of work. Okay, uh, Anya used even three word combinations. Who else is ready? Roma. 
As for me, uh, studying uh, at the Lyceum associate with extracurricular, uh, extracurricular activities uh -huh. because I am a member of uh, Drama Club and uh, I took part in different uh, concerts. Performances. Pe performances, mm -hmm. yes. Navchanya uh, associates. How do you say it? Passive voice, right? Uh, associate. The whole sentence. Uh, studying at the Lyceum associate. Is associated. Yes, studying is associated. Yeah. 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 Uh, studying at the Lyceum is associated with extracurricular activities. Good. Uh, Alena, what about you? Uh, I agree with Roma. Uh, and, uh, uh, Can you uh, use any other words? So I wrote noun and uh, the adjective. What is noun, by the way? Noun, imanic, and adjective. Pragmatic. So you can use attention or attentive, concentration or concentrated. So Alena, use, use any other word. Do you remember that to skip the lessons, for example, do you do it? Uh, what is the translation of this expression? Uh, so do you do it? Uh, no, I uh, don't. Uh, I don't do it. Use the best combination. Yes? I don't. I don't skip the lesson mm -hmm. uh, because I think that. Uh, um, Every lesson is important, and uh, we can uh, we must uh, to attend every lesson. Mm -hmm. We must. We must attend every oh, lesson. Too. Yes, Julia, what about you? As for me, the lesson is a new way of uh, studying. Here I uh, here I get a lot of uh, practice skills and learn them every day. I think it will be very useful in my future life. Okay, uh, yeah, uh, studying in Lyceum may, uh, makes me uh, ambitious and uh, thanks to hard working I uh, get uh, top marks. Good, Timothy, you uh, In this Lyceum I am uh, seldom late for classes and I uh, try uh, uh, not skip the lessons in, in general because uh, I understand that I uh, must be uh, maybe more attention on the lessons and uh, not uh, skip the lesson. Mm -hmm. uh, I, I try uh, not uh, to skip. Not to skip. Будьте уважним. Yes, I try to be attentive. Okay, uh, so we have um, some word combinations which you didn't uh, use. For example, to learn something by heart. I mean, I give uh, some example. Do you learn anything by heart here? Uh, it is uh, difficult for me uh, sometimes to learn, uh, to learn the word poems by heart. In Ukrainian? Uh, in, in, Ukrainian. in Ukrainian literature, yeah? But you try to do it, right? Are you concentrated at the lessons, Vika? What is concentrated? Uh, no, no, no. So that's the selection in right here. So are you concentrated at all the lessons? Um, no, why not? Um, because um, uh, sometimes I'm ner nervous. Nervous. Um, and, uh, um, and that is why? Because. Um, no, and that is why you are not concentrated, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. Uh, do you often have oral or written tests in different subjects, Anya? Um, we have uh, oral tests or written tests, uh, but I don't like oral tests uh, because... Do you have written ones? Uh, yeah. Do you like uh, written ones? No. No? no. You don't like tests no. at all? Yeah, I always uh, not concentrate on in tests. Yeah, yeah, that's quite I I'm not uh, concentrated, mm -hmm. and I uh, uh, get bad marks, maybe. And you get bad marks? Uh, Sometimes? Yes. Okay. And uh, what subject are you interested in most of all, Yerina? Of course, uh, most of all, I'm interested in uh, English and uh, Germany. Because German, German. In German, because uh, I entered to the uh, foreign language class, mm -hmm. and uh, I entered the foreign language class, and uh, I uh, wanted, to, and now I want to study uh, foreign languages. Mm -hmm. So, to part the lesson, and the lesson, no problem. Anya, what about you? What subject are you interested? Because I'm interested uh, in, in, in English. English uh, and uh, maybe history, because uh, we all need uh, history uh, to enter the university. Mm -hmm. And uh, we pass all exams. Mm -hmm. 
Are there any things um, besides subject that you are interested in, Alona? Or are you interested only in studying? I I am interested only in studying. What ending? I am. I am interested in mm -hmm. interested in only in studying. Uh, maybe because I want uh, to uh, uh, I want uh, to um, to pass uh, my exam in future, and I want uh, to enter at the university. But nevertheless, I believe you should uh, find, you are young people, you should find time for some relaxation, for some hobbies, and to be, you should be interested in some other things. Okay. So, uh, your home task was to uh, prepare uh, dialogues or dramatizations of, uh, of some moments of your life at the Lyceum. Uh, so, you have now time to practice all this, and then we will... Uh, See all, all these things, all dramatization. So you're welcome. A scene from Life of the Lyceum. Are you all pupils in this group? Yes. Yeah, oh, okay, so then listen to their dramatizing and be ready to characterize what kind of pupil they, uh, they are. You know a lot of adjectives. Do you remember them? So how we describe a pupil, whether uh, having positive or negative characteristics. So be ready to describe these pupils according to their dramatization. So you are welcome then. subjects was history, English, Ukrainian, and world literature. 
Besides, I took part in different Olympiads. This was a very interesting for me. But the most interesting was after uh, school activity. In my former school, I was a member of drama club. I was a member of drama club. It was very interesting. I was played the role of Cinder Cinder Cinderella. I think. <laughs> I don't remember. Uh, besides, I had been dancing for five years. Which is interesting. Yes. Uh, I, uh, before I finished school, uh, I was a good, good, good dancer. Uh, in general, it was a very, very interesting. Extracurricular activity gave me a lot of life experience and made a great influence on my life. Okay, sit down, Roma. You have some mistakes, but your mark is 10. And, and, and what has happened? And we cut. And now you see, uh, so you see it happen. Some people work hard and uh, some pupils have good marks. <laughs> Not in general, because maybe, not maybe, he is different, of course. But here, what kind of pupil, Yura, is he? Uh, as I see, Roma is a very active boy. Mm -hmm. uh, maybe he has a sense of duty because he felt in love with uh, you. Fell in love. Fell uh -huh. with you, but... Uh, Does he work hard? In, the, in this situation? In this situation, he only read Anna's exercise book. So he was lazy then, that he didn't yes. do his exercise? But all this because of love. Ah, he so you, you just justify, you justify him because he is in love. No, uh, wait. This uh, situation uh, sometimes happens in our lives. Happens, happens. I see. So, Yarena, what can you say about Timofey? Uh, Timofey, has, uh, Timofey has a gift uh, to sport, uh -huh. for sport, and uh, he is a sporty boy, and uh, uh, he is hungry. He was hungry. <laughs> is it connected with his hobby? Must yes, sport because yes. sport uh, need many needs many energy. Needs much, much energy. energy yes. Yes. Uh -huh. And what about Anya, Alina? What can you say uh, about Anya? Anya is a clever girl. She works hardly. And uh, she works hard. Uh, she uh, has a, a sense of duty. Um, is she a friendly girl? Is she uh, ready no, to help? She, Why not? Uh, did uh, she help your classmates? Yes, yes. yes she did. In general, to be concentrated on uh, the lesson. Uh -huh. And the lesson. She is to be concentrated on something else, on the lesson. Right, yeah. Well, thank you very much for your dramatization. So, um, Anya, that was your word. Um, my friend Remy. Oh, Remy. Um, Anya, why did you do not do your homework? Why did you do your homework? Why didn't you do your homework? Roma, I didn't have to prepare. I couldn't prepare. Mm -hmm. On page 95, we have to show you the rules. We have to show on the page 95, because you have number, no article. Roma, це було дуже цікаво. It was so interesting. Так, я грав у драматичній роль цієї зовсім. I played. Played, you know, what you played. Then, а хто це казав? Дає позакласна діяльність, дає мені можливість Рома здається, так? Yeah, I'm going to do it. Yeah? So the class is going to give me a chance 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 to give me a chance. If activity is then give. If activity then gives. So you can use activity and activities both. Then activity singular gives and activities give. I'm going to put you up to it. And Yulia is an active man. He's very active. He's a very active man. Though there were some mistakes, in Roma speech, but as for others, in fact, not much, uh, not many of them. So I believe that uh, all of you deserve well for your dramatization. I'm
Okay, so in this um, dramatization, you showed how you prepared your homework, as how Anya prepared, and how the boys prepared. Does uh, preparing homework take much of your time? Yes, yes. all yes. our time. All Very your time. And imagine a friend of yours asks uh, for a piece of advice, how to <coughs> prepare homework in the best way. Can you do it? Are you ready to help your friend? Even if you are not, you will do it now. So in your exercise books, write down at least two pieces of advice to your friend how to prepare homework in the uh, Yula, uh, Yula wrote, uh, if you live in a hostel, you can go to the classroom because uh, your uh, neighbors uh, can, uh, de, uh, can interfere with you. With you. <coughs> so it's better to learn uh, homework in, in the classroom. Mm -hmm. Yula, what about Yarina? Yarina uh, wrote uh, that... Uh, Yarina advised me. Yarina advised me that we have to fight our laziness because uh, it's a problem for our today's... Uh, and how team. to fight laziness? With a stick or how? Uh, you have to... Uh, you have to have a strong view. Premusho button, maybe, yourself, yes? yes? You have to make yourself yes. do your homework, yes? And not to uh, just speak with your friends or something like this. Good, Vika, what piece of advice did Natasha give to you? Um, Natasha uh, said me that... Advise me? Advise me. Uh, that if I want to do my homework, what I must uh, um, be... I must be attentive, mm -hmm. attentive, attentive, and um, um, do my homework more uh, four hours. More than four hours. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. For a long time. Um, yes. Good. There was a mistake, but uh, I, I have forgotten it. Sorry. So, Anya, what about uh, uh, Alona? Says me that uh, we must sleep a lot. Uh, it gives us uh, energy, uh, and uh, we can uh, do all our uh, tasks and be active at the lessons. Does he mean that uh, you must sleep after uh, I know, after the lessons or at night? Enough? I think that uh, we uh, also can sleep uh, after the lessons, but uh, not uh, very long. How long? Uh, maybe one, one hour, but, one not, hour. but not more. But it's better to have a walk, you see? The weather is wonderful, and then to sleep at night. Okay. Roma, uh, Timofey, what, what do you use, Timofey? Uh, no, no, no. Says. Says, or, uh, tells, tells, tells me, or tells me, yes? And uh, it gives us. Okay. Yes, and Alona? Uh, I want to, I want to, um, I want to say Anya's advice uh, because I think it's interesting. Uh -huh. Anya said that uh, we must, uh, uh, we must concentrate uh, our attention on the lesson because uh, when we uh, did, when we do it, uh, we. Uh, all, uh, uh, we uh, can uh, learn everything on the lesson, and when uh, we uh, came uh, come home, we uh, can revise it and quicker. Yes, yes. Uh, at the lesson. At the lesson. Good. Do you like everything which we have in our lesson? Do you want to change something? Really? Yes. Uh huh. Tatiana Mikhailovna is absent, but Svetlana Mikhailovna is here. Now. 
Uh, you will uh, give your suggestions to Svetlana Mikhailovna and somebody will translate for her to understand and she will tell us uh, whether she uh, or uh, our authorities can change something. So, Yarina, please, Svetlana Mikhailovna, what do you want to uh, her to change? Svetlana Mikhailovna, they want to change something in the face. So, louder. I would like to get uh, to Sasha Mikhailovna that uh, she should Two showers on the floor, Timothy, translate it in Slavic. We want to make a mistake, but we want to make a mistake. Yes, it's possible. 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 Yes, it's Oh, in our rooms, or maybe... In, in, all, the, in all the rooms? Yes. No, it's the same as the rooms. It's the same as the rooms. It's the same as the rooms. Is it possible? Yes. I say no, but if there will be a computer and a TV, then there will be no one in the room. Okay, Alena. Uh, we want uh, to have a maid because she uh, can help us help. help us to clear the room. To clear the room. Yes, we want to clear the room. The maid is on the floor. Ми хочемо покоїв, які вибирали наші кімнати. Ви знаєте, це можливо, якщо включимо це в оплату вашим батькам. Скажемо, платіть за покоїв. Ми хочемо мати фрі вайфай. Ну це зрозуміло. Вайфай у нас є, ви знаєте, що наш заклад його отримав, знайдемо місце, звідки всі буде тиловик і буде стати. Це скоро ми будемо. Ви хочете мати свимінг пул? Свимінг пул. Що це вам хана перекладається? Басейн хочуть. Ага, ви знаєте, це дуже добре, я думаю, що викопає. Ладоша? Тенісний корт. Це реально. Стіл є, потепліє. Не зовсім корт, для малого тенісу. Для малого тенісу є. Корт у мене, але стіл є тенісу. Ви хочете мати шеді? Шеді. Тому що це не важливо. Це не важливо. Це не важливо. Історію в один день важко. А розклад треба змінити. А з чим ви пропонуєте поставити історію? Фізкультури. Три пари фізкультури. Це потрібно. Вони на інший день. На інший день. На той рік, я думаю, що... Подумаю, що ви робите. Окей, дякую дуже. Ага, Альона, це ласт. Ви хочете мати ліфт на зелі. Тому що ми йдемо на зелі. On the stairs. On the stairs. Uh, it's terrible, I think. Ah, we want a lift. Yes. We want a lift. So it's better to make a lift, and then in the supermarket, such a lift. It's a scale. But that's for the price of the house. That's for the price. No, I don't think it's the price of the house. I think it's the price of the house. I think it's the price of the house. And it will happen. I believe that Lana Halina answered your question. Thank you very much, Lana Halina. So, so thank you. So these were only dreams, yes. But nevertheless, you have some other dreams about what ideal school should be, right? And as far as I know, you have prepared presentations, yes, and projects. Okay. Who wants to start? Okay, so Yulia, uh, <laughs> Yulia and Yarina. Okay, so uh, okay, so now uh, the girls will show uh, their presentation about ideal school, and your task is to ask them questions. Mm -hmm. Our ideal school. Motivation is very important in our school because when people see it, they will uh, they will like it, and they will want, want they, their children to study in this school. Such a way, there will be many students in school. Our uh, future ideal school will have more than teachers robots. They will be instead of real teachers. Maybe this will increase unemployment, but I believe that in the future the spheres of job will increase, so this program will disappear. 
uh, in your style of uniform is very important because uh, it will uh, show that uh, our school is elite and uh, there will be pockets for all necessary things and uh, it will help uh, it will help pupils uh, to adjust uh, for the work and study uh, our future school will have modern blackboards uh, this is a this a new it's a new way of showing information. Students will remember all that information better. Besides, uh, there will be a free access center which uh, meet uh, free internet. New, te new, new, technologies is, uh, new technologies are very useful because uh, it uh, will make it will develop children and uh, make their and uh, <coughs> teachers' life easier and comp more comfortable. For example, uh, Max uh, will help. Uh, some pupils to hear other pupils. Mm. Uh, there will be a corner of nature. It's a good place for having rest. Uh, pupils will have uh, better relations because uh, they will be taught how to take care of plants and animals. Uh, I think it's a good corner to make their relations better. Uh, comfortable uh, lockers are very useful in every school. Uh, in our school, uh, pupils uh, will uh, pupils need uh, to uh, need to uh, need to carry their stuff with them uh, all time. They will keep them in the lockers and uh, take family lessons. Mm -hmm. uh, our lessons is a new way of studying. All the lessons will be held not in a school building. We have chosen this kind. Uh, maybe children will. Uh, will remember all the lessons better, but everything depends on weather. A comfortable dormitory for students is very important part of our school because uh, there in our schools uh, will be big uh, big rooms uh, with uh, good repair and uh, children will uh, feel uh, will feel like at home. Uh, places for rest uh, will be held on green uh, territories. That's why people's health will be better. At the first picture, we see uh, uh, the facility of entertainment for adults, and at the second, for little kids. I think uh, all the pupils will like this yard. Of course, there will be big canteen in our school. Uh, pupils will have their breakfast and dinner. They will choose uh, uh, food which they want and uh, they will be able to sit in a company with whom they want. <coughs> Our ideal school will have uh, big swimming pools. Uh, it means that uh, pupils will involved in uh, sports sections more and uh, our pupils will help and uh, go to the lessons every day. Modern lifts uh, will help people uh, to, uh, to move quickly and not to be late for lessons. Welcome, Welcome to, to our ideal school. school. Thank you. Your questions to the girls. Pleasure. What do you think uh, is it uh, possible for such a uh, school in Ukraine? Maybe such a school will be in Ukraine in a few hundred years. In a few hundred years? Yes. You are pessimist, girls. No, I realize. No, you are real. It's not okay, real, you know? Uh, what angles will live in your natural form? Uh -huh. <coughs> uh, there will be a lot of animals, but uh, they will be a little in size. Uh, for example, there will be uh, different kinds of fishes, hamsters, snakes, uh, 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 turtles, and others. Turtles. 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 Yeah. Uh, will your school be free or only for rich people? Uh -huh. Or should parents pay? No, I think, I think you our can say no. Resolve the no. no. I think I think our uh, uh, all people will be able to uh, uh, to study in our school. Not only rich, but uh, if uh, somebody uh, has uh, documents, uh, what uh, rich will show that uh, they uh, don't have money for uh, rich education, uh, uh, they will be able to study in our school. Mm -hmm. So we some documents. I know I said that the ideal school will have uniforms, but uh, um, more pupils don't like wear many, many pupils. Many pupils don't like wear uh, uniforms. So what about this? Mm -hmm. uh, I think that every person has uh, they uh, all, uh, has uh, sta uh, has style, but they will be able uh, to wear their clothes after lessons. 
and uh, on the lessons of uniform will help them to adjust uh, to uh, study and uh, it will show that our school is a good Okay, thank you very much. It was good presentation. So, Yerina, will you translate the word, pronounce the word, Presvichaya? Mm -hmm. Юля, здається, твоя фраза, що уроки на відкритому повітрі – це новий спосіб. Так, уроки на відкритому повітрі – open lessons. Open lessons are the new way of science. А, not easy, but how you do it. На картинці, Юля. In the picture. Ярина, компанія. А, компанія. Компанія, everybody. Oh, good, thank you. Uh, good presentation. Well, also there were small mistakes, but we thank you. Okay. Our mission of school of the future is based on the principle that every student should have access, equal access to all levels of learning. Many new technologies uh, will be used in our school. Uh, they support immediate and virtual face-to-face virtual -face communication uh, between uh, students, teachers and parents. Let us imagine a school building of so-called uh, think for itself type. Our school can control all automation in the house. Our school building is unique. It's really great. Uh, it's, in this picture we can see the building uh, with many uh, windows. Uh, good lighting uh, helps us in the study. Uh, we can see a building uh, which uh, um, a form, uh, which a form uh, of uh, some books. Um, our school building will, uh, will be uh, secure and take hand um, creating a relaxed uh, environment for learning uh, on an individual or group basis. Between nature uh, and students, we are always a uh, in our school, we can uh, do some activity. We can do some activities. Uh, we can develop our talents. Uh, we can have uh, a good medicine equipment. Uh, we can go on excursion. Um, uh, we have a good opportunity to go into sport, and uh, our students uh, have a good uh, and healthy food. Uh, on the background, uh, we can see uh, the school of art. Um, this is uh, building has the form of some fences uh, <coughs> and some unknown things. Uh, it's a building uh, with uh, uh, many bright colors. We think it inspires. Uh, the students can make uh, their masterpieces there. Uh, maybe some of them will become a great artist. We hope on it. Uh, there are many good, clever, uh, honest and polite teachers in our school. Uh, adventures learned uh, uh, techniques uh, will be introduced uh, to make learning easier. Uh, one of such uh, technologies um, could be mnemonics remembering uh, sync by linking them together in some way. Um, it will just become most, uh, more friendly to pupils. Um, it will uh, give uh, the opportunity to get uh, uh, interested in uh, what uh, one studies. In the school of future, the voice of each student will be heard because we think that they must have uh, a say in what they do and how they do it. We think that the education is going to become easier. We consider our school to be an ideal one. Thank you very much. And this is a question for Ayana and Natasha. Ayana. What is the library, uh, real library? Will there be? Uh, Real library. Will, will there be? Will there be a real library with real books, or will uh, your pupils will use internet? Will your pupils use only the internet? Uh, there are many libraries uh, in our school uh, because we think that uh, the pupils uh, sometimes uh, must uh, to uh, use the books uh, uh, than the internet. Must.
Uh, yes, uh, because our school uh, is ideal, uh, and uh, we think that uh, uh, everyone uh, want, uh, wants wants uh, uh, to study here. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, can uh, when your school give good knowledge? Yes, uh, the best uh, techniques uh, are uh, used in our school. Mm -hmm. And you know. Uh, what inspired you to make your school in the form of books? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, uh, we made our school in the form of books because we think that uh, the books uh, is a symbol of uh, uh, knowledge. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you very much. Good also project. Natasha, will you pronounce it the name? Equal. Natasha, repeat it. Equal, uh, unikal, unique, unique. Uh, then uh, uh, Natasha, школа у форме книжок, школа є у форме книжок. The school, the school is, 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 uh, is in the form, in the form of books. Mm -hmm. Then um, Alena, книжки це символ, знаєте? Uh, the books uh, uh, are symbols. Ah, yes. Uh, Natasha, створювати. Yes, you did. You made some mistakes. So uh, now let's fill in this table. So I don't know. Read the first uh, line. Yes, yes. One hundred percent of students go through primary school from what age? From uh, from five uh, till till eleven. And you remember you said seven years. Yes. Uh, and now you see that it's five. Good. Anya, the next one. Uh, 100 students. Percent of students. Percent of students. Uh, go, go to what kind of school? To secondary school from? Uh, from 11th. It's a GCE examination. Doctor, what is it? No, it's not ZNO. It's DBA. To get an attestate for the middle of the world, you need to know that ZNO is for students. Okay, so Timofey, in the next line. Uh, 50 percent of students continue studying at school, and at uh, 18 they take A levels. Mm. So what is A level? A means advanced. Advanced. Advanced yes. level. Uh, advanced level. <laughs> and Timofey says how many? 15 percent. Do you agree? 50. 50. How many percent of students continue? You were not attending 20, 20, 20 percent. And the last line, Roma? Uh, 20 percent uh, of... Percent, percent. Uh, 20 percent uh, of uh, 18 years old uh, go to uh, the university. Yes. Uh, and as, uh, uh, tw uh, 20, another 20 percent uh, go on to other kinds of education and, uh, and training. Training, and training. training. Okay, I'm sorry, you were right. In that line there were 50% and here 20, 20. So you were attentive. Good. So um, some more questions as for the video. So do all the students wear uniform in Britain? Yula. Most of them. Most of them do. Mm -hmm. What foreign languages do they study, Alina? In French, Italian, and Spanish. And at what age do they start? At the age of 11, right, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, what games are popular after classes? Sport games, I mean, Timothy. Football what? is popular after lessons. Uh -huh. Football, what else? Rugby and badminton. Mm -hmm. uh, what subjects do they study, Alona? Uh, they study uh, geography, uh, uh, English literature. Uh, Anya, what else? Maths. Maths, yeah. Music. All of them study music. Do all of them? No, on the side of them? Yes. Uh -huh. And? Design, if you say, yes? Mm -hmm. And food and technology. And religion and food technologies. Okay, so did you like 
uh, school, uh, schools in Britain as for uh, this video? Not bad school. Not yes, bad? but in the Lyceum it's more interesting. Alona, <laughs> very good word. You keep in the school, school, but it's better to study at our Lyceum. <laughs> good. But would you like to study at least for some period of time, for one term, or for a year? Yes. Yes? It would, so it would be. Uh, it would be very interesting and we c uh, could uh, promote new we could learn? I could learn new things. New things, something new. Good. It's a good uh, experience. And it's a good experience. Okay, good. So, uh, what conclusion can we make at the end of the lesson, Roma? What have we learned today? What have we practiced today? Uh, at this lesson, uh, we learned uh, that uh, we learned uh, um, a lot of information about British school, yes. about British education. Uh -huh. What else? What, what else? A lot of ideal school. Yes, we spoke about yes. ideal school and we discussed. School of the future. Yes, we discussed school, school of the future and we discussed what. Your life at the Lyceum, studying at the Lyceum. So I'm very grateful to you for your work. So uh, especially your home task was good. You know your marks for home task, but for working class, your marks uh, not so high because you made graph mistakes. Timothy 10, Roma 9, my dear grammar, Anna 10, Alona 10, Lisa 9, Yulia and uh, Yarina 11. So uh, your home task for the next lesson will be